certainly does look like something out of a movie. Security cameras capturing a man climbing through a ventilation shaft to break into a Bill Ricca restaurant. And wait until you hear how police caught him. WBZ's Julia McDonald is live in Bill Ricca for us tonight. And Julie, he didn't take anything, but still costly for the restaurant. Oh, yeah, David, it's been a mess here. So the restaurant was back open for dinner tonight, but closed all day yesterday, Thursday, and for lunch this afternoon. That's a lot of lost revenue and wages for workers. Plus, everything inside had to be thrown out. Condiments, cups, containers, because of the mess that this suspect made. One of the chefs, they came, and they saw, they called me. And so what happened here? The surveillance cameras inside the Liberty Bell kitchen in Belrica captured each determined and destructive move as a man broke into the restaurant early Thursday by removing an HVAC unit on the roof and sliding through a ventilation shaft. He was looking for the office where we keep cash, safe, everything. So he went to the basement. When he went to the basement, he didn't find anything. Darting through the basement and then creeping around the kitchen, the suspect carried the restaurant's fire extinguisher, which proved to be a poor choice for a tool in his attempts to break down the office door. Between the HVAC damage and the chemicals from the extinguisher, the restaurant was coated in a film of dust and debris. Around ten to eleven thousand dollars in food that we need to throw away because it was infected, and we understand. And we need to hire a, a company that license to do all the deep cleaning. The suspect didn't get away with any cash and exited the same way he climbed in. Investigators say white, dusty footprints led them straight to the apartment next door, where police arrested 33-year-old Michael Nault. As the restaurant adds up the thousands of dollars in damages, their team already feels support from their Bill Ricca customers. We uh, apologize, or oh, sorry for the uh, business got to be closed. And they say, no, we understand you, we are here for you. When you open, we are here and we start doing business with you. So Nalt was arraigned in Lowell District Court today, released on personal recognizance and told to stay away from the restaurant. Police say he does live next door. Live in Bill Ricca tonight, I'm Julie McDonald, WBZ News. That is some story. Julie, thank you.